they're fun, but they also help you. I was like all excited saying like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna get a laptop and it's just gonna be for me and no one else could use it. Our goal is to create quality producers, self-directed learners, and collaborative workers. You might think, oh, how can technology help with that? It could be anything from them co-editing a paper. It could be them filling out their own reading log and reflecting on their reading, producing their very own book and publishing it. We all benefit from technology on a daily basis. And so it really opens up our, our learning, not only in the classroom, but it extends it places where it never could have gone before. Being able to focus on a screen has actually like helped my brain. It makes it like a lot easier to like focus and learn. It's really handing over uh, a, a resource to the kids that's, that's almost infinite. There's a lot more of having them explore and research rather than me saying, okay, this is the answer to blank. The learning now that we're all looking at is not necessarily that we're the sage in the front of the classroom, but that we provide a, a way, an effective way of learning and they can access the content and the answers and we sort of guide them through that process of finding quality content. The way that technology is coming into the classroom is really creating this blended learning environment and putting it into a classroom of the future just enhances that learning. The amount of self-directed learning that goes on in this classroom is so great because they come in, they decide, hmm, which chair do I feel comfortable sitting in today? Oh, I'm going to use my tablet to look up these words. If I don't know them, I don't need it to find my teacher. I can ask a peer. I have so many different options to be self-directed. It's probably all going to get like even more advanced probably. So every so I like to like start young so I know like everything about it. In the high school level, you're looking more so as you know, what are they going to do in their college career or possibly in their future careers? Uh, but I think with younger kids, you're just getting them used to exploring and learning and researching. I would want to see it next year because it helps you with math, it helps you with writing, it helps you with reading. Students need to be able to learn and produce and explore in the 21st century and we'd be really doing them a disservice if we didn't incorporate technology and creativity and production and put it more so on them and the ownership on them. When they have it right there, it's, it seems so natural. It's their world now.